Welcome to the two minute drill with EnvisionTel. During this tutorial, you're going to learn how to use Enlightened CRM to pass student records from Moodle over to Salesforce.com. In our previous two minute drill, we set up a new user in Moodle and then using certain triggers over in Salesforce.com, granted this user specific access to a, a course library that they were going to be allowed to see. So I'm gonna pick up from there, and as I've logged in, we can see under my courses that I now have access to Understanding Product One, which was the account trigger that we set in our previous tutorial. Clicking into this course, you're gonna see various bits of information. For example, uh, course documentation. These are some PDF files that I need to review as part of my course. Uh, in the middle here, we've got a section called Course Exercises. In this case, these are just some SCORM compliant flash files that we created using Adobe Captivate. And then finally, there's a certification exam which we built directly inside of Moodle. And this is just a 10 question test uh, that will quiz me on my comprehension of the uh, course material. Now, since this is a two minute drill, I don't have time to take all of this content right now. But if we jump over to salesforce.com, we're going to take a look at just what kind of information is passed back to Salesforce using the Enlightened CRM application. So I'm looking at the ENV5 contact record, which is a contact, a part of a company called Vaporware. If I scroll down, you're going to notice some related lists that are now associated to this contact record. I've got one called Enrolled Courses. There's another one called Quiz Attempts and another one called Visited Modules. Now, Visited Modules is really just tracking whether or not I have viewed certain pieces of content within a course. In this case, there's some content um, called Course Outline and a message from our product manager, which if you remember, were just some PDF files that were located in the documentation section. There's uh, some quiz attempts, which actually keeps track of any of the SCORM compliant content that I've interacted with, as well as my certification test. Now we actually keep track of multiple attempts. So if you allow anywhere from three to five or however many attempts you allow somebody to complete a test, we'll actually document each of those attempts over here in Salesforce. And then finally, once a student has completed their course material, we can actually keep track of when that course was completed, uh, whether or not it is in fact completed, uh, what the overall course score was, and also some unique identifiers that identify that that course has in fact been completed over on Moodle. Now all this content is documented here in Salesforce, which means we can now run reports using the report filters located in salesforce.com. And that's how Enlightened CRM tracks information in Moodle within Salesforce. That concludes our two minute drill for today. If you'd like to learn more about e-learning solutions from EnvisionTel, please contact us at www.envisiontel.com.